I hate to say it, but most healthcare providers are checking your blood pressure wrong. And even if they did it properly, we know that just being in clinic can cause changes to your blood pressure that can be misleading. And that's why everyone needs to know how to take their blood pressure correctly at home. Measuring your blood pressure at home? Great. But did you know that just one small mistake can throw off your results and your entire treatment plan? Mistake number one, measuring right after exercise. Always rest for five minutes before taking a reading. Two, using the wrong cuff size, too tight or too loose. It alters your number significantly up to 10 points. Three, crossing your legs, keep feet flat. Crossing legs can raise your systolic pressure by 10 to 15 points. Four, placing the cuff over clothes. Always place the cuff on bare skin, not over sleeves. Five, incorrect arm position. Your arm should be resting on a table, same level with your heart. Too low equals false high measurement. Six, talking during the reading. Even small talk raises your BP by 10 to 15 points. Seven, needing to pee. Yes, having a full bladder can raise your BP by impressive 15 points. Empty it first. Eight, taking just one reading. Always take two readings at least one minute apart. Then average them. Nine, not relaxing beforehand. Take a few deep breaths. Stress affects your numbers. 10. Caffeine right before measuring. Wait 30 minutes after coffee or tea. Caffeine, in someone who doesn't regularly consume it, can briefly increase their systolic blood pressure by up to 10 points. 11. Measuring directly after meal. Blood pressure dips after eating. Wait 1 to 2 hours. 12. Wrong time of day. Best times? Morning and evening before meds or meals. 13. Leaning or slouching. Sit upright with back supported. Bad posture affects readings. 14. Not calibrating your device. Have your machine checked once a year at the doctor's office. 15. Skipping regular logs. Track your numbers over time. Patterns matter more than one-off spikes. Home BP checks are powerful, but only if done right. Fix these simple mistakes and you'll get real numbers that could save your life.